we get three distinguished tough women name at the end of this panel here today. If anybody survey the, the feminist gender field in a salon, you could also we get some of the fire brand name. On the far left, I want to introduce the Honorable Catherine Zainab Tayawali. Seated next to me as somebody who they make in second appearance now. We are the Honorable Mariama Zombo. On my right, I get Naya somebody who the people who say me well. Mama and Pekin not for married. Big woman or adult and Pekin. Boy Pekin self not for married. Adult man and girl Pekin. We not 18 yet. Then not for married. Now the law is prohibition of child marriage act 2024. This act or this law, now law we initiate, we come out from with first lady Dr. Fatima Madabio. One third of the girl picking in this country, they married. Ten be there were seven percent of boys, they married under the age of 18. 800,000 girls. Adolescent girls marry. That one day is huge. And we day among the country there. We get the highest rate of child marriage in the world. I look for work for picking them. I talked to Fatima, the press is her excellency. I said, This bill laid on. Why would not go pull them from the child rights and make them make a, a separate bill where it can come as a private member motion? He agreed. And it will be a legacy of the hands of our girls. Because you're not going to get something as a first lady. You go freely without bringing something. We go stand the test of time. And so for girls, we call them a pro bono project for the benefit of Sierra Leone. We they run at them and then they. As this law don't pass, we go run at them. May they not say we they run at them. Because Ansabele don't don. Tell your neighbor, say Ansabele don't don. Why you give Pekin Bele? The law they tell you, not so we they tell you now the law. When you keep picking Bele now, the law they tell you. And if you go for go answer Bele, you won't sit down there for answer Bele. Oh. You the imam, oh. you the DJ, oh. you the pastor, the law they hold you neck. This is, you know, funny. It's serious. When then they mention one third, it's like almost 30% of adolescent girls in this country, before they turn the age of 18, don't become wives. It's a serious issue. The Honorable mentioned 800,000, not a small number, than in a big number. So that's why we, as people in from the activist or civil society lens, or we where they boldly claim feminist, um, from that sector, they, we really appreciate the fact that a law like this don't come into existence. But you know, activists there now, we are glad you, but we still get for use with protest voice for acts for more. But before I do that day, I want to commend first the honorable them for all the work we them put into making sure that we get an explicit law, we ban the practice of child marriage inside this country.